I know. I got all your toys. Oh. You gotta finish these lights. Doesn't nothing but rain. Alright, rope and ball for each of you. Oh, and another Chewy box. Which one of you ordered that? I got it, don't worry. Buddy, you got a little in the nosy. Got a little in the nosy. Rally. Is that good? Yeah. Lotus. Enzo. Stay here, buddies. Bye, boys. Lotus, come. Enzo. That was not a line change. Get in here. Jeez. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. So not only do you guys eat a lot, but your SUV that you must have requires quite a bit of gas. Granted, I didn't fill it up the other day. Did you bark at the strange people? Yeah. You get bad vibe. Did you get the bad vibes? Where are we gonna go today, boys? Every day is like a struggle of, do we go to our normal park? Do we go to a different park? Do we go to a new park? You know, I know they love our normal park and they feel comfortable there and I feel comfortable there and it's close to the house but then other times it's like well you guys want to experience something new and now that we're doing the daily videos it's like well I'm sure you guys don't want to watch the same park every day and I don't want to edit the same park every day so in that regards it's good because it kind of forces us to go to different parks more frequently assuming I think they're okay with it I think a lot of you can probably relate to the struggles of getting ready in the morning with shepherds. Where are we? Oh, got the new parky. Well, you've been here. 
You've technically been here, just not to this section. Ah, sit. Enzo, come. Heel. Lotus, heel. Sit. Somebody asked what kind of car this was. We get that a lot. It's a Toyota FJ. Heel. Brake. Check out the views. On views, as they say. Lotus. Really? You know, we get a lot of people saying how they're getting a German Shepherd or they want to get one. You know, one of the struggles we've had to adjust to is knowing that people are going to be afraid of them. I mean, some people are just afraid of dogs. It doesn't matter. It could be like a Chihuahua and they're freaking out. Um, but Shepherds can definitely invoke some fear into people. And then one of the things I've had to personally get used to is, you know, I know they will recall if I call them, but other people do not. And I do the same thing. When we're out places and I see dogs without leashes, it does make me nervous. So one of the big things that I've made a point to do in the last several months is anytime I see people, because I put them in a heel just to kind of like one, if they're in a heel, people half the time don't even realize they're not on a leash. And even if they do, they see that they're they're listening. So I think it puts them a little bit at ease. And all these new smells, huh? We've literally had people, like, we'll be walking, especially Enzo. I can remember some times when it was just Enzo. We'd be, like, walking him on a leash. And people would just straight up see us and turn around. Like, I'm going to go a different way. It's like, really? How many trees can you guys pee on before you run out of pee? What'd you guys find? Find a little trail? Yeah, I mean, I didn't know this trail was here, but I guess we can, I don't know that it goes anywhere. But yeah, we can check it out. Looks like an antique staircase. even go anywhere anymore? I don't know. I don't know boys, it's a little steep. I don't know how I want to walk back down this. Um, yeah, that might be a trail suitable for you guys, but I can't really go that way. I can go this way though. Lotus. Oh, okay. Careful. Oh yeah, connects to the other part. Okay. And apparently we ran out of staircase. Lotus, Lotus, too far, come. Oh, we are, we are much higher now, boys. I kind of see the FJ. Lotus, come. Come view we got up here. Boys, too far. Lotus, come. I don't know how I feel about going back down that though. This is really steep. I think we're gonna walk around the long way, boys. Come on. Oh, this dog way back there. Wait, I can't see down there. Hold on. So this appears to also be an old staircase, but they deemed it safe enough. <laughs> so they put a railing on part of it. Lotus, too far. Lotus, come. Enzo, come. It's like, wait, do I have to come too? Heel. Good heel, heel. 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 Let's 
stay in the heel while we're by this road. 25, I don't feel like anybody's going 25. So we were way up there. We came all the way around. Oh, gonna get that bird. Jeez, seemed a little aggressive. Sit. Oh, good sit. Just good sit. That's good boys. That's good boys. Break. Good boys. Really? Why? I don't get why there's so many cars here all of a sudden. What are all these people doing? They're just like hanging out. This guy didn't even get in a parking space. There's like 80,000 parking spaces. Sit. Oh, good sit. Just a good sit. Why did that guy beep his horn? Heel. No. Don't beep your horn at my dogs. What is wrong with you? And why would you beep at somebody? Oh. And I don't like to lie to people, but it, honestly, sometimes it's just the easiest. What am I gonna do, sit there and explain? Well, Enzo is really friendly. Lotus is really friendly too, but he's also very afraid. So he's gonna bark and growl and freak you out. But then if he gets to know you, he's, he, he's friendly. So I'm just not gonna do any of that. And I'm just gonna say, no, they're not friendly. To the strange guy who came to the park in the morning and didn't park in a parking space, despite all the available parking next to the other weird car doing who knows what. I think I'm remembering, Enzo, why we don't really come here that often. Oh man, boys, you see all them geese? All them geese? I think we're gonna go down here to another part of the park where it's, uh, this is a massive park. I mean, I said yesterday the park was big. That park may technically be bigger. I don't know. This one is like multi-layered though, so it's kind of weird. It's kind of hard to tell exactly. I'm inclined to say that this one is probably bigger. I know boys, that wasn't a whole lot of exercise. Don't worry though. We're gonna check out this field and see if it's, uh, see how wet it is. It hasn't rained in a few days, so hopefully not too bad. Hopefully we get less creepers this time. <laughs> ah, sit. Enzo, come. Lotus, in. Lotus, sit. Lotus, come. Heel. Break. How's it look, boys? You look very wet. We're at the bottom of a hill, so... Can tend to be more wet. Seems okay, though. Yeah, run them down the hill. I'll wear you out. What you doing, Lo? Lotus, find anything good? Oh, and so it's gonna agitate, I think. Nope. <gasps> yeah, I mean, I think they like the comfort of their own park, and I think they are very excited to be there and, and everything, but I think new is always better. That's Lotus's motto. Oh, gotta go poop. And so I have no idea where you went. Well, thank you, Enzo. Break. This way. Potty. Now I got the zoomies.
And we're down. <laughs> Lotus, you just guaranteed yourself a top wipe down. You don't care? Well, guys, we could have done this at our park. <laughs> That's how we know Lotus is getting tired. Look, let me just lay down. A long time ago, that building was like the water plant, and I think what we're standing in, you can kind of see like the wall there, kind of goes around, and there. I think this was basically like a water reservoir. We used to come to this park and it would drive me nuts staring at this wall, trying to figure out why it was the way that it was, and like what it used to be, because you know, you can see it there, and then you can tell that was kind of part of it, and I had to come here quite a while before one day I real I walked past that building and like read its sign, saw a water plant. I was like, oh, okay, now it makes sense. So it was like, why did the path go in a circle? You wiped out? Yeah, I figured. Lo, you king of your own little mountain? Oh, let me go get him. We get this question a lot. Um, we feed them gentle giants. We used to do Royal Canaan. Um, as you saw in the video, I do mix it basically. I, it's just a can of soft food of gentle giants as well. We buy the chicken and the salmon and then we mix it together. And then the soft food, typically we buy salmon. Um, we, we have bought chicken before, but try to keep it consistent. Sometimes they're out of stock of one or the other. Right now they're out of stock of salmon, so I didn't order any of the soft food. But we still got some left. I think we'll be all right. We don't use, I don't mix a lot. The wife does. All right, Riley, we got you new food too. You still eat Royal Canaan. We typically do four feedings. We do 6 a.m., we do noon, although I'm a little late, it's 1240 right now, um, 3 p.m. and 6 p.m. Right as I was feeding them, I got a text from the wife. She handles a lot of our comments, as I know a lot of you guys do. Somebody said, I bet you a dollar you won't respond. Well, if any of you guys have known our channel, you know that we respond to every comment. That right? Yeah, I said that's right. So we we got the response. Yeah, we said we do the response. You gonna knock my camera over?